Okay, so uh, this is Cora. Um, basically, these are the design. As you can see, the design are pretty complex if you're just getting started with the software. So, I really recommend you to watch my previous suggested video before you enter this one because it's pretty important to understand the basics. Okay, okay so uh, let's so dive in. And uh, in the design section, as you can see on the left side, there are lots and lots of layers and labels and names and everything because, of course, um, this project. It, it's not just about code anymore it's also about design okay and the complexity of the design as well which again important and even matters in the prospect of learning frame and become successful in frame later on okay so uh, later we will uh, try to code um, the entire thing that we already designed here um, if you're asking that, can I can I build the, the the different thing from from Cora? Maybe, of course you can do so because um, I can fairly say that the code principles are of course the same, <clears throat> like states, animations, um, loops, events. All of them can be implemented in different sources of projects. So feel free to use your own project as the basic milestone in this case. Okay. So here we uh, already dive into the code section. Um, we define the scroll components and uh, we create multiple screen states and events and build dynamic animations. So as you can see, I uh, do speed code because if it's a manual one, it's going to take a lot of time, probably almost um, 30 minutes. So I will do it concisely and explain it later, okay? So scroll components here used um, to enable users to scroll. Of course, the name already depicts the functions. Um, and uh, if you see that, like post scroll and stuff, that is basically the name of the new scroll components. And I connect to the parent of profile dot pose and stuff. So it will be attached to the parent, which I give the name, which belongs to. Um, some um, other objects in this case okay and uh, in this case and now I'm building states like I'm building the states of click so basically if these objects like home avatar home to avatar blah 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 click and it will change the color to those hex code I've shown you on the screen um, you can basically activate this kind of um, animation using switch okay um, later I will use switch in this case to define um, each animations um, to work in harmony okay now we define the history section now, if you check on the right side as you can see what are the untold story of our world history basically that is the history sections okay and uh, astronomy is below the history, as you can see. What are some interesting facts about CF21 and others, you know? So these are the sections that I uh, give an order to be able to drag later using draggable enable true in this case, okay? Um, and I also add constraints, like constraint means like the size constraints, so it will not get any bigger or even smaller that I want to do, so it will go to default of the size, which is better, and you will see how it works later, or probably already did on the intro, okay? And uh, this time I also uh, built the drag sections, that means when it drag, what happens, something like that, so when um, some, you know, some sections are dragged and then um, it will collapse and then it, the position will be replaced by another section, so something like that. So it's going to be pretty dynamic later, and you will see how it works, of course. Or if you pay attention in the intro, you did see before. All right, now here we got the arrays here. Basically, I want to uh, um, put out the scrollable function from for the navigations, as you can see later as well. Um, on the profile sections, okay, 
and uh, in this case I'm using arrays and I uh, define different arrays for uh, different layers in this case um, you can you can you can build one only it's it's okay if you're just getting started but again if you're not familiar enough please please I do really recommend to watch my other suggested videos on the corner click it out before you get lost okay frame is a is an entire big universe here you might get lost somewhere but you know click on the suggested videos to watch the videos okay now we're adding um, another thing such as um, the states of click okay from answers and stuff so answer here it's basically uh, the you know the answer section so um, if I go with the profile later and there is this answer sections when I click answer then only the answer will be filtered okay and I want that that's how Cora works right they also filterize whether it's answers or questions distinctly okay pretty good now I want to activate the states color so when I click it, the states of these different objects on the scrollable you know navigations later on the profile screen when I click it, it will change its color. Pretty simple, pretty amazing dynamics and unique as well. Because it's kind of fun in my opinion. Okay, so uh, the rest will be repetitive. Basically, I do the same thing for other object names and etc. You know, <clears throat> and these object names are mine. Op mine are mine because I'm I create this. So if probably it goes different from yours then you probably need to create your own object okay so keep in mind that the names here are predefined already in my projects 